Hi everyone, it's Gwen from Hummingbird Tarot, and today I'm doing another video in the series of RWS Verses. And the purpose of these videos is to compare a deck that's based on Rider Waite Smith against a Rider Waite Smith traditional deck, just to see where they're similar, where they're different. This is something that I already do for myself. Every time I get a new deck that's based on the Rider Waite Smith system, I find it interesting. I like to see where they're similar, where they're different. And so I thought I'd like to just share these comparisons with you. So this will include a flip through of the deck and we're just going to uh, do kind of a, a shorter re review as we're going through the deck. I'll give you my notes and comments on the deck. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and don't forget to hit the bell so you're notified every week when I upload a new video. Today we're doing the Crystal Visions Tarot by Jennifer Galasso. These both come in your standard tuck boxes. It has your standard white book inside here. It just goes over, you know, some of your standard meetings. Nothing too special in there. This is what the back of the deck looks like. These are really pretty. So the card stock is a little thinner than um, the universal weight. And I can tell just because the pile is sitting just a scotch lower than my universal weight tarot deck. So this is pretty thin. This one's a little thinner. I already think this one's thin. It does shuffle nicely though. Do you like thick or thin card stock? Let me know down in the comments. I have mentioned before I put clothes on my nude people in my tarot decks when I'm going to make a video of it. I do have young people that watch my channel from time to time and I'd like them to be able to keep watching my videos. So that's a reason why I do that. So you can see here's some clothes here, and then she has some clothes I've added, just a gold paint pen touched up a little bit. If you have an opinion about that, feel free to let me know in the comments too. That's pretty. So this deck, the Crystal Visions, feels a lot more romantic to me. And there is an extra card called the unknown card in this deck. You can leave it in or take it out. It's up to you. I'll probably take it out. So you can see this is following some of the traditional meanings. It's a little similar, but it's not in your face exactly the same but it's some interesting artistic choices from the difference between the two. And there's so much water in the cups in this one. They're standing in the water in every scene. Tears. Some of them like this one, very similar to the original. And some of them are so different that you have a hard time seeing the original notion in there. The 
That's very cool. This one it looks like the poor the poor horse is carrying the burden, not the man. Thanks for stopping by.